All right, thank you, Emily. Well, new at noon, the Panthers are back in town, which means it is training camp time. 7 News reporter Ben Hoover is live now at the Wofford College campus. Ben? Well, Fred, some players came in yesterday, but the remaining players came in this morning, and we caught up with some of them. Of course, uh, this comes at a time with the Panthers under new ownership, and uh, the future of training camp here at Wofford is still unknown. We do know that training camp will happen this year, of course, and next summer, and then after that, a new contract would have to be negotiated uh, between Wofford and the Carolina Panthers' new owners. This is big for fans and also big for economic development as this, uh, the next several weeks, pumps a lot of money into the local economy. Uh, we were there earlier today. Our cameras were there as the last of the remaining players showed up. Uh, today, uh, they rushed them in pretty quickly because they were delayed by that wreck in Gaffney. Uh, today, they will be doing weigh-ins. In fact, I believe they're doing that right now and then team meetings later on this afternoon all ahead of tomorrow's first practice. We caught up with Christian McCaffrey as he arrived this morning. Here's what the second year running back had to say about what he brings with him to camp. Uh, I bring, uh, my betting is extremely important. I uh, bring all, all the right betting, making sure I'm sleeping well. Uh, other than that, I keep it simple. You know, I got a little smell fresh thing in there, making sure I come home and the room smelling not like a dorm room. And <laughs> bring my rug, because they're hardwood floors, so. I try, to, I try to make it as homey as possible in there. So the running back likes to keep it fresh, Fred. Uh, of course, practice starts tomorrow, 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. at the fields behind Gibbs Stadium. Uh, before that, of course, for the fans, the kickoff party here at Gibbs Stadium, that will include on-field performances by the Top Cats. Also, uh, the mascot, Sir Purr, will be here. The mayor's ball delivery. Base painting games, they, they go all out for this, and it is, of course, free. You can check the practice schedule at panthers.com. We'll put that on our website as well, wspa.com. Uh, but we will be here all throughout the afternoon and bring you more on this first day of Panthers training camp week as it begins here in Spartanburg.